Good day to y'all, my name is Ryan, this is Down to Business Reviews. This week, we're reviewing Adventureland, directed by Greg Matola, starring Jesse Eisenberg, Ryan Reynolds, Martin Starr, Kristen Wiig, Bill Hader, and Patrick Stewart. Wait, who? Kristen Stewart. Kristen... Uh... So Adventureland is Matola's follow-up to 2007's Superbad. Jesse Eisenberg's character, whose name is James, has just graduated college in the summer of 1987. He takes a job at a theme park, Adventureland, to help pay for a trip to Europe. While working in Adventureland, he learns about life, love, and the great mystery that is this adventure called life. By all accounts, this movie shouldn't have sucked, but it did. I believe this movie was trying to be a comedy, but it wasn't funny. It was trying to be a drama, but the drama wasn't interesting. It was trying to be poignant, and it failed to be poignant. The problem with this movie is it didn't make me hate it, it made me feel nothing. Even if you make me hate your movie, that's fine, but if you make me feel nothing, like I just wasted an hour and a half, that really gets my goat. Jesse Eisenberg, he's a good actor, you know, in the social network, he can act, but in this movie it's just... Blah. Ryan Reynolds will always be Van Wilder in my mind, so it's hard to take him seriously at all. He's funny, but he's not a good dramatic actor. He's just not. Bill Hader and Kristen Wiig had some good moments, but it, their parts are really small and short-lived and not worth an hour and 45 minutes. Surprisingly, the most believable and relatable character is the character Joel, played by Martin Starr. He was genuinely funny and relatable. His character you could actually empathize with if you've ever been an outcast. When it came to, you know, Jesse Eisenberg's character, James, you're supposed to empathize with him, but his life isn't that terrible. We've all had awful jobs. Boo-hoo. Oh, and you're vying for the affections of two different women? <laughs> Bummer, dude. Okay, let's just talk about Kristen Stewart so we can get it out of the way. I don't want this to be a review that's just bashing on Kristen Stewart. She's had enough of that. You can find that crap anywhere. The thing that bothers me most about Kristen Stewart is she doesn't have to be a bad actress. Just look at a movie like The Runaways, where she plays a young Joan Jett. She was great in that movie, probably because she was allowed to be disheveled and it fit the character. But she has this failure to emote. God, the frickin' lip bite. Just, just run your hands through your hair if you're feeling turmoil. That will convey the emotion. It gets really old. Jesse Eisenberg was in two movies in 2009 that ended with Land. Watch Zombieland. It is so much better than this piece of crap. However, there were some good things. The soundtrack is pretty awesome, actually. Say what you will about the 80s. There was some great music. If that's really all it has going for it is a couple of good songs and a few moments where actors really do click, it's not worth your time. Perhaps my biggest gripe with this movie is that it was just boring. You don't care for the characters. You don't empathize with them. You don't care about his struggle, because it's not really a poignant struggle. Most of the characters aren't even likable. Ryan Reynolds' character is a jerk. Kristen Stewart's character is an idiot. Nobody is likable in this film except for Bill Hader's character, Kristen Wiig, and Martin Starrs. And they have minimal roles. That's about all I have to say about Adventureland, unfortunately. I wanted it to be good, but you can't win them all. It was disappointing. I can't say that it was a complete bomb, it wasn't amateurish at all in how it was shot, but the story was not compelling, it was boring, and by the end, you wish you'd have watched something else. I'm giving Adventureland a 3 out of 10. That's it for this week's review, thanks for watching, if you liked anything I was rambling on about, please like and subscribe, leave a comment down below, I really appreciate it. Uh, tell your friends, and I will see you next week. Thanks for watching. <laughs> Kristen Stewart. Ugh.